we are begging. If you have any, any humane in you, anything in you that can move you to just make you give us something, just give us something. What's more heartbreaking to me is last night I had to explain it to my 10 year old that his uncle is missing. And I asked him, how did he feel? He said he doesn't know how to feel. What's good guys, welcome back to the Milk Carton series. I'm your host Stephanie, if you are new to the channel. But nonetheless, I'm still sending you guys prayers. Hope you guys are staying safe and washing your hands. And yeah, so let's get into today's video. So today guys, we're going to be discussing 43 year old Keith Johnson. Keith is missing from the Washington DC area. He has not been seen since July 31st of 2020. Now his family and friends say it's very unlike him to just disappear. Keith is also listed as 6'1", weighing 210 pounds, and he has black hair with some gray in it, along with brown eyes. He was last seen wearing a purple shirt with jeans, and he had on he had on gray and white sneakers with a black hat. I seen on the 1800 block of Tobias Drive around 8 a.m. on July 31st. Now, the thing about his case is his vehicle was found it was found in 3700 block of D Street Southeast in Washington, D.C. When his vehicle was found, it had a significant amount of blood in the vehicle from the reports. Now, there has not been a body found, but Keith is still missing. And we don't know what may have happened. And there hasn't been any new information regarding his disappearance. Officers were able to get his wallet from his vehicle, but none of his bank cards have any transactions on them. And there also was a report of a woman being missing in the same, around the same area, not too far from Keith. But I did find out that it was later that her boyfriend was charged with her murder. Now, there has not been any correlation to the disappearance of Keith, but when Keith first went missing, Olga Oral, hope I'm pronouncing her name correctly, she they thought that her case was probably tied to Keith. Not really sure if maybe the same person that got Olga had did something to do with Keith, but there has not been any and there has not been any information regarding that logic. Police have searched areas of where Keith lived but there has not been anything to turn up far as his disappearance now he's still missing and i thought it would still be great to share his story because you know i stress that a lot sharing stories gets more media attention and sadly i have not seen his story really around i searched facebook only thing that i could really see was just local news articles so i'm sending his family love and light and i do hope that some new information turns up and i'm also sending olga's family love and light as well because she was murdered and i'm trying to stay hopeful when it comes to keith because there has not been any new details as far as his disappearance so guys, that's it for today's episode. If you have any new information regarding the disappearance of Keith Johnson, all links will be down below so you can reach out to local law enforcement.